In this video, we're going to talk about workhorse, trading under the ticker symbol WKHS. Workhorse is an interesting company to look at in what happened in the past and what it may have for us in the future. The stock was subject to a lot of speculation back in 2020 and in early 2021 because it was bidding for the USPS contract and many thought that Workhorse was the favorite in the process. And then the contract went to another company, which caused Workhorse's price to nosedive. The stock price went from a peak of $40 on February 5th to a low of $8.10 on May 14th, and then recovered from there onwards. It first went to $15.53 on June 11th, before retracing back to $11 in recent days. So overall, Workhorse's value has been significantly impacted by the outcome of the contract, but I think that the market has now adjusted to its new realities and willing to keep a foot in the company. Actually, there are two things that will greatly influence Workhorse's future stock price. The first one is how the industry at large is doing. That is the industry of electric vehicle. It seems like late May has been a date when most EV stocks began to take back previous losses. I think that the market's interest in EV vehicles is both edging upward and cyclical. People found a refuge value in EV sector back in 2020, and now that need seems to be no longer there, or at the very least, much weaker than how it was needed back then. At the same time, many companies decided to keep the sector in mind, with the anticipation that it'll become more important in future, especially considering that new combustion engine vehicles will no longer be authorized to be sold in many countries within the next two decades. The second element is Workhorse the company, Workhorse itself. It sets itself apart by having a product, and that product is a solid one, at least solid enough to compete against other companies in bidding for government contracts. The existing fleet owned by the federal government and its corporations is expected to be replaced at an increasing pace for the years to come. And this is why I believe that we have a lot of possible opportunities to profit from market hypes or real contract winnings. Overall, I think that Workhorse is a company that can be kept in the portfolio for EV stocks because it already has a real product. It's relatively low in price for the moment, and we know that there are true values for the company looking ahead. If you're interested in owning some workhorse shares, if you're interested in owning some workhorse shares, now is a good time to buy because it's very close to the cheapest point in 2021. In terms of how much you should be buying, I would recommend to buy between a third to half of your allocation right now. The exposure overall, like the overall total exposure in Workhorse that I would recommend is around 3% of your portfolio. Thank you for watching. If you like my content, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel.